Thanks for joining us on this episode of Our American Travel. In this episode, we're going to have a walkthrough, a tour of our new Grand Design 2500 RL. I'm going to go through a couple of the specs with you on the 2500 RL. I'll try to uh, post them maybe up here on the video so you can see them. Uh, it has a dry weight of about 5,850 pounds. It has a loaded weight of up to 7,500 pounds. Uh, it's about 29 foot 10 inches long. Uh, and then the interior size is about 25 foot long. It has freshwater capacity of 52 gallons, a gray water capacity of 90 gallons, that's two 45 gallon tanks, and a 45 gallon black water tank. So uh, it gives us a lot more flexibility uh, to boondock, do lots of other things. Uh, we, we've so far, we've had it out a couple times. We love it. Uh, stay tuned for this tour. I hope you'll like it. Start here at the front of the trailer. First, we have our automatic, not automatic, um, power jack. One really cool feature. It's got a light. I really That's like cool. that. Yeah. We have two 20 pound propane tanks and we have two batteries. Uh, the reason we have two is because we have a solar panel on top. This will help us get more solar energy somehow. Um, and then one really cool feature, it's not got a purpose, is it's got this little lighting strip which just makes it look really neat. So way to go Grand Design Imagine. Oh, I didn't even see this when we looked at this trailer. I was so excited when we came to pick it up. This is just really neat to me. Um, we do have pass-through storage and for us, compared to what we had before, it is humongous. Um, I Would love- you say twice the size? Uh, yeah, it's higher and is it wider? Yeah. No, um, I love this little command center here, and I love the fact that your water comes up through here and attaches here, so you're not attaching on the outside. I just think that's really neat. And you can use that to fill the fresh tank or when you're using city water. You also have um, access for an outdoor shower, hot and cold water, woohoo! Um, we have cable if you want to plug in satellite or cable. Um, tell me again what this is because I get it wrong every time. Solar controller readout. Okay, there you go. And here is the... Actually, the solar controller. Right there. And it also comes, tire link, um, comes ready to put in the TPMS. And, hey, we uh, can link the video above if they yeah, have to see that. Yeah, we did. Yeah, Al, last week, that was our last video. Um, hook that together. It's pretty awesome. And the fact that you got somebody on the phone right away and they were willing to walk you through it, awesome. Hey, just gonna go through here really quickly. Gravity feed to the fresh water tank. In case you have a five gallon bucket or something. Yeah, a light, in case it's dark when you need to connect all of your um, things down here. And we have a black tank, two gray tanks, double axle, woohoo! Yeah, a slide. You mean like there's two tires? There's two tires, yeah. Two axles, yeah. Two axles. Awesome. Uh, we've got a slide, yeah. And we did purchase a slide topper um because we wanted to and we back here's where you plug in your electric well, it's more than we wanted to okay it helps protect the slide yes and we definitely wanted to do that here's where you plug in your electric we've got the four stabilizers they are not automatic they're just regular yeah we use a drill yes all right come around the back we have this bumper where you can store your uh black tank thingy <laughs> what do you call that Hose. Hose. We've got this really sturdy ladder that holds up to 300 pounds. Your handy dandy spare tire. And it does come ready for um, backup camera, which we have bought, and that'll probably be our next video, or our next one or two. Um, we're going to install, or actually, Al's going to install the backup camera. He's over there. All right, here's the other side of our pass through storage. And look at all the extra space that we have. Um, didn't those used to take up almost the whole thing? Our three buckets? No, but they kept up a, a good half of yeah, it. Yeah, okay. And, and we couldn't stack them like we could now if we wanted to. Awesome. Okay, we also have a GFCI plug in in there. Yeah, there's, there's a power plug that's on the GFCI circuit. Yes, that's yeah. correct. And another motion detector light. <laughs> yeah, that's yeah. awesome. Now that's um, got a magnetic lat latch up at the top of the door here. So you can see it just pops down and it stays up with a magnetic latch. Um, our, imagine, uh, whatever, 2500 RL has two doors. This is actually the door to the bedroom. 
comes in handy for a couple of reasons. If you're at a place where somehow you cannot pull out the slide, this is the only access to the bedroom. So you would have to like come out of the living area, come in here to go to bed. That's awesome. Also, if like you found yourselves like us, you can't find a place to stop to go to the bathroom, you have access. Well, you could go in right here. You could in go in right here. Yeah. Sorry, the screen door didn't open. Well, yeah. And there's open. the bathroom. So yeah. the bathroom's right there. You can kind of see it's there. It's kind of handy to have a you little can bathroom. Get in even with the sliding because it slides all up in the front. Area. Yep. So awesome. Awesome sauce. sauce. I really like this. Cut this whole kind of area where you could tailgate if you wanted to. Well, you got, let me talk about this first. You have access to water over here. Let's say you're at the beach. Let's go to the beach. And you need Let's to wash off. Yeah, yeah, right now, today. Which way's the beach? You know? Uh, no. You know, look at me. Which way's the beach? Yeah. Okay. Um, water. If you wanted to go to a football game, you got a place to plug in your TV, a coax cable right here. You know, we could have outdoor movies at the campground. Let's do it. How we... This is awesome. Okay, um, we've got a 23 foot. 21. <laughs> I got that wrong like 14 times. Awning, so super yeah, awning. This is like take three on the video, just so you guys know. Yeah, it is. We've had a lot of technical difficulties. And you could just sit out here with your chairs, watch stuff, cook, eat. Awesome. We need All a little, stuff. yeah. We need a Blackstone grill so we can come out here. Yeah, we're going to get, get yeah. one of those. Then we're going to come to the main door. Did you mention about the insect uh, things? No. Here's some insect yeah, I think things. you guys need to know about that. I think these are important. Yeah. Did you get these so you can, you can not have uh, insects in your This bed. is hot water here. This You're is there. the heater there. Yeah. And um, just so you know, like we had a whole video on the RPOD 192 where Al installed these, but these, they told us at the dealer, are very, very hard to install. Yeah, they don't look all that hard. Okay. Well, we had them installed there. So it's up to yeah. you. Have they you installed yours? Free, so, yeah, you know, that's true. I, I always like free. I mean, we did buy them there. They cost a little bit more than yeah. Amazon, uh, but. Maybe. maybe okay. But. All right. We got, we got a discount, though. So. This is one thing I've wanted since before we ever bought one. One thing. One thing, I wanted a lot of things, were these solid surface um, lippert stairs. Yeah, they go all the way to the ground. Okay. Yeah, yeah, and they've got these um, nice non-stick thingies. If you're like us and you had to live in your... Non-stick? Oh, yeah. Non-skid. Non-skid, thank you. Because um, we kind of wanted to stick a little bit. That's true. We actually were in our R-Pod when there, we had two ice storms and uh, our steps were covered with ice. Yeah. So... Um, yeah. You don't want that? No. Really easy to put in and out. Got to make sure you have the door open all the way. There you go. I heard there's a magnetic catch over there. Is that true? I was about to say that and I forgot. Yeah. Okay, well, you know, you can't be forgetting. And the stairs go up. Oh, you're going gonna to put the stairs on. Oh. I made a critical error right here and Almost. didn't check for the screen door. We're going to jam those steps right into that screen door and see if we can break the screen. We've tried that several times We've already. We've probably almost done that. There we go. It's going in. Oh, wow. And look, look at this little thing right here. If you're going to open them, all you got to do is kind of pull back on that. And then she's got a little handle there. And uh, I just missed all that on the video. And uh, we're trying this little wireless mic that's not wireless. Welcome to our new trailer. Isn't it awesome? I just love it. Um, what are you going to tell us about? Everything. Everything. Or do you have three hours? Yes, let's okay. go. Let's take three hours. Uh, first thing we have is this really cool control panel. How cool is it? It's so cool. It's like motion sensitive. So if you noticed, it was dark, but we came right up. All the lights came on. Right here shows us all. I didn't notice. Shows us all. Oh, I got on. It was on. Okay. <laughs> we got our fresh tank, black tank, gray, gray battery. Why do we have two gray tanks? Because we're that's so like double lucky. gray. Is that that's still we're gray? So lucky. We're so lucky. You mix gray and gray, and you got okay, gray. Whatever. Um, use your lights, use your pumps. No, black your, and gray, that'd be different. Your water pump, your water heater, gas and electric, awning controls, slide controls, cool. Um, do you mean do you mean that you can control pretty much everything right here? You control a lot. Yeah. And what's really what's this, awesome? What's this connect thing mean? It's Bluetooth that'll connect to no an way. app on your phone no called Compass, and what? you can control all of this. Compass from the com connect? Yes. Wow. For instance. There was one time when uh, we were sitting on the couch. No and way. I went to the bathroom and we weren't plugged into water, right? And uh, Al turned on the water pump from here so I could flush the toilet and wash my hands. 
Here it is. Here's Compass Connect. So cool. Am I connected? Oh, oh yeah, it says the ceiling lights are on. Turn the ceiling lights off. Oh, Hit that little, see the little green button down, 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 down. Oh, here. cool. <gasps> That's pretty awesome. Now, it doesn't control these lights. We have one light on in the dinette. Yeah. Can you open the slide from here? Yeah, yeah, it's down here. Wait, you want to... Where? Somewhere. I don't know. Uh, awning. Where's the slide? I don't know where the slide is. All right, never mind. I'm in the wrong mode. I don't know. Let's turn it off. Right. Hey, welcome inside again. Um, this is our living area. And one thing I really love is these windows. I think I've said that in a couple of other videos. Uh, when we parked, we'd recently camped at Craighead Forest and you could see the lake through our back window, which is pretty awesome. And we have these really nice recliners. I'm going to take a nap, you don't, if you don't mind. Oh, yeah, this feels yeah, great. Yeah, this is okay. a normal Sunday afternoon. Yep, summer. it certainly is. Um, we're not plugged into power, but if we were, I could turn on massage or I could turn on heat. There's also an extra little light here. It doesn't give you any light. It just is really cool effect. We have so much storage. We've got kind of like your husband, a cool effect. Yes. <laughs> We've got cabinets on either side and this goes down so far. It's way back. And we have an outlet on this side, electrical outlet, an electrical outlet over there. So if you're wanting to sit here and be on an iPad, phone, computer, and you need your battery charged, it's all right there. Welcome to our dining room. We still have our table strapped in for um, drivable safety. It's just a second, it's too dark in here. I need some extra light. <laughs> it didn't work. It's uh, a one touch. One touch. Unless she touches it. But they're also room darkening, so they actually make it really dark at night. Look at that, automatic light. So cool. Um, this is our dinette. We have two people on each side. Really, really cool. This table is actually portable. You can take it out. Put it out front if you want to cook on it. Something so cool back here. You think this is a U-shaped dinette where this is unusable space, right? Wrong. Again. Wrong again. This is actually... You generally underestimate us. You could take this out. And it's a storage look ottoman. At that. And look at the look at the, there's like a heater in there. Yeah. Pretty look cool. At that. Awesome. It That's holds a lot of stuff. Oh, smells good. My, my feet. No, it was the new. It smells new. Um there's also storage <laughs> down here. I'm a little disappointed in the storage. I wanted these doors here. The R pod did not have doors, but there's just not a whole lot. And back in the back is pretty much unusable space because it's really hard to get to. You can take the cushions off if we had to put some stuff down there. It's not there. really unusable. It's just a more long-term storage yeah. than short-term. Yes. We've got one on each side. Right here is the other. And let's say you're working at the table, mm -hmm. but you're you're about to die. Your, your device. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry, not you. If, if your you're device. about to die, it's probably good time to call 911. Yeah. All right. So we have a phone charging like a USB, plus it's got a USB-C. It's yeah, so Yeah, the latest, the USB-C. And then down here, we've also got an electrical outlet. So you don't have to move somewhere. You can plug in you got, you got right a place there. to plug in right here yeah. in the slide. That's yeah. awesome. Here's our refrigerator. In our previous uh, travel trailer, RPOB 192, it was one of the Demet. It wasn't a Dometic, was it? It was a different brand. But anyway, it was gas or electric. This one is 12 volt or electric. And it runns off the solar panel. Um, well, it runs off the battery. Battery, the solar yeah. Solar panel charges the battery. Thank you for clarifying that. You yeah. know, I'm a science teacher. Yeah, you are. <laughs> I know. I, I, physical science. No, that's that. not my best. Okay, so um, one advantage of these is it starts to cool almost immediately. It's not one that just takes the hot air out. It it's actually not like starts cooling. Yes. Cooler. It's, yeah. it's a regular compressor. So here we have lots of space. I've left these in here just so you know because you guys, when we start saying stuff that's wrong, correct us because yeah, we're, we're still we've been doing this about a year, but we're newbies because we're only like part timers. That's right. Not okay. really full timers. One thing or I even most timers. I got Alzheimer's, but are you done? No. Yes. Okay. Thank you. Sorry. <laughs> One thing I love about my kitchen, welcome to my kitchen, is so much storage space. I just wanted a place how much, to- How much space? Just a lot. So 
so much. A countertop space. I wanted a place to put my telephone, telephone, my coffee pot. Yeah, that too. Because in the art pot, I had to put my coffee pot on the sink cover. So we put our coffee pot here. We could also put it here. Um, I don't know where else. If we need extra countertop space, look what we've got. Oh, that's, now that's unbelievable. You mean it like holds up? It does. And this is thick. So it's not like a little flimsy. And it's got, it's not like a little flimsy thing. It's got these two little levers down here. Put it back down. It's got a really large sink that comes not with a cutting board, but a dish. Hi, how are you? Good. Um, you see how big the sink is? It's so big. Well, the sink, it's so big that... How big is it? I don't know. I'm thinking, I'm looking for an analogy. Okay, I'm, I can't I'm, think The metaphor it. is just escaping me. Okay. Um, lots of cabinet space. Um, hey, if you guys got any good sink metaphors, let me know. Yeah. Lots of cabinet space. Because I will use them next time. Here we go. Here we go. So Look at all that. We don't even have stuff to put up here. I know, right? Um, I love having drawers. I've got four drawers. One, two, three, four. How many? One, two, three, four. How many do we have in the R pod? Zero. zero. Okay. Yeah, we loved our pod. But we did. Zero drawers. We like. Okay. So we got a microwave. It's pretty small. I got to warn you, my tray is already packed up and ready to go for yeah, the next Yeah, we're ready to roll. Trip. Yeah. With, the with that. Um, we've got a three burner stove. Gas. Such a cool thing. It's got its own <laughs> igniter. So I don't have to use a lighter to light the gas stove. Um, yeah. Yeah. It's got its own lighter. Yeah. Igniter. And then here, I'm sorry, this is the, not the stove. This is the stove. Stove is pretty small. My husband tells me we can lower this rack down. Um, all of this is like the heating part. There you go. More storage. More storage. A lot. Oh, and I forgot to show you the storage up here. Woohoo! Look at it all that like storage. Airlines. Yeah. It was the stewardess thing. Yeah. And we also have the stewardess thing. Right here. Yeah. Yeah. Right here. Oxygen masses will uh, oxygen mass will drop down. Okay, and that's put flight them on attendant. Your, put flight them on you attendant, first. not stewardess. Oh, with that, yeah. I'm sorry. Okay. I'm sorry to all the flight attendants out there. Please don't unsubscribe. <laughs> this is a Roku TV. So it's a TV that's got Roku built into it. Yes. They, they do that. They do that. Oh but we've also got an antenna already on top. Yeah. Also, you can if you hook to cable at your campground yeah. or satellite um, or satellite. So it's got many different functions. It can pull out. I'm yeah. not going to do it. We're going to do it now. And you can actually turn it to where both people can see it it's quite like well. It's like 45 degrees. And yeah. Yeah, we'll, we'll show that sometime. Maybe. Sometime we will. When we're napping um, and stuff. Yeah. yeah. And that is our kitchen, dining, living area. Hey, sorry. I just need a little privacy, okay? No kidding. <laughs> Come into our bathroom. I, I don't know if that's a good idea. <laughs> Uh, we have a window, one touch shades, except for when I do it. Yeah, most of the time we, we leave that closed. Yes, we do. It's a pretty big window, and it's right across from the shower. Uh, triangle storage shelf. This is his, this is mine. That's like the one with three sides, right? Yeah, a triangle, three sides. Yeah, cool. A little bit of stuff here, cabinets here. I mean, they're pretty narrow, but your happy camper will fit there. Probably put laundry detergent, dryer sheets there. I won't fit um, there, I'm a happy camper. Here is not a lot of storage. Um, no. Yeah, yeah. Not a lot. Yeah, there's lots of, lots of uh, duct work and stuff okay. like that down there. Uh, we have a pretty large shower. Does it have a door? It, oh, we forgot the door. It does have a door. I'm kind of worried about this door. Yeah. Because I've heard you can kind of get locked into it and not get out. Like, yeah, like now. So we're locked out of it. Now. There you go. I got it. So yeah. I've heard of people heard of people that have actually hung shower. What about that shower head? What do you think about that? Um, I'm not a fan of the shower head. We have run it. Um, we had one similar to this in the R five one and two. That was just a trickle. It was yeah. horrible. This one does have, have more than a trickle. Yeah, yeah. yeah. There's no water miser. So we're probably going to replace that. That'll be another video. All right. What about um, what about these? Oh, I forgot. There are not one, not, not two. two but three, three fans, fans in this trailer, the yeah. RL 2500 Grand Design Imagine. And Sorry. look, there's a little switch. Turns the fan on in there. Oops, yeah, there's some stuff in there. <laughs> there's bugs in there. Oh, yeah, by again, the way. That, yeah, again, that was fun. Is that bugs or? Yeah, it's a dead bug. Okay. Um, if you're small, I mean short, like me, like me um, I cannot reach the way to open it, so you need to have a stool. I have a stool. Um, 
Yeah. Just get a one. A stool. Yeah, get one. Okay. Oh, it's, forgot. It's We've got like a, moving buddy. a porcelain toilet here. Yeah, the throne. And, yeah. and it's, as um, Matt and Matt's RV reviews say, like, prime pooping position. That's so gross. It is gross. Okay. But you know, you can set and, and you know, you got Excuse me. Elbow room I room. need to be alone. Okay, thank you. Hi. She does this to me all the time. Can't get it open. Ugh. Hey, how are you? Yeah. Sorry. I just shut me out. Again. Need a little bit of alone time there. Okay, welcome to our bedroom. Hang around me um, enough, you need a lot of it. The uh, if you haven't, if you can't tell, the mattress in the Grand Design Imagine RL twenty five hundred is a Sealy full queen mattress. But let me tell you, it is a rock. Yeah, it's it class A rock. Yeah, it was hard. You know, you, you know, there's firm and medium and soft. This is rock. Right. So we got a topper to put on ours. I'm not gonna. Now our previous camper, we had a we bought a, a home mattress. We did. We bought a home mattress. And, and I guess if we try this and don't like it after yeah. a while, we'll just get a home mattress again. Okay. There's not a lot of walking around space, but that's okay. I like have. I didn't think I would mind not having separate space, but I like having separate space um, because I tend to get up early, go to bed early. He tends to get up a little bit later and stay up a little bit later. Um, we have on each side a closet. And this closet is wide. I've got enough for a shoe rack thing where we usually put t-shirts and shorts. And I can hang up some stuff and it goes really deep. So I've hung up- Way on back here too. Yeah. Deep. Look, look how far my arm goes. Yeah, she doesn't have an arm anymore. Yeah. Um, when we stayed in here while we were working, I was able to hang quite a few work clothes there. Yeah. Um, and I didn't yeah. wasn't able to do that quite as well when we were living in our art pod. Yeah, not, not with that up for sure. No. Well, no, I had to take it down. Yeah. And then there's two drawers, and they're a little bit small. This is kind of deceiving. Looks like they'd be big, right? But they're not. But actually, they're deep, and they do hold quite a bit of stuff. They have plugs here, and then we have a That's secret. A, it'd be really good for a full week. Oh, definitely. Yeah. Oh, yeah. There's so much. Yeah. And then there's so much place you can put stuff oh, for definitely. another week. Oh, definitely. Yeah. There's and so then, much then space. Then you need yeah. to probably do laundry pretty soon. Yeah. Oh, I we're going to have plenty of room. Um. We also have two overhead compartments here in in your cabin, in your flight cabin. Yes. Um, one thing I like is that um, this is up high, so you're not going to watch what I do. This okay? You're not going to hit your head when you do this. <sighs> um, I have done that. A lot. I've done that, I'm and I've hit my head. Like that. <laughs> um, this is a problem. I'm not sure. We've got this really cool little cubby hole here. Yeah, look back there, cubby hole. Um, we eat, we have lights, which is awesome. In the cubby hole, what's in there? The cubby hole has got an electrical outlet. Yeah. And it has a USB plug-in and a USB-C plug-in. Oh, wow. So here, Al, it's got I got my own little fan. personal fan. It actually, you put it in there and you put it in the USB and it blows on you right there and you'd be surprised how... Um, how do you turn it on? Well, you, it's working. Yeah, you'd be surprised how much air, air that thing moves uh, out oh, wow. of the hole there. So. Wow, that is a lot of air. Cool. So anyway. All right. Um, I love the fact that it's already got lights in here. And it has that same thing on both sides. Yes. And then these lights are like twofold. Yes, they are. Like a little night light kind of. And then and then, yeah, and then a reading, reading light. light. Yeah. Okay. One thing we need to see is there is a lot of storage under the bed. Yeah, we, we've been forgetting about that. We have. So again, if you wanted to stay here long term, you could keep a lot of stuff under here. Yeah. And uh, do we need to? So you can see, there's some trash down there. That is the bedspread that actually the came, with, that came it. with it. We need to throw that away. That. Yeah. And it's got this drawer it's here. Got a floating. Floating. Yeah. Well, it's not floating right now, but um. It's supposed to float. Yeah. It's stuck. Pardon us while we work on the floating drawer. <laughs> now it's worse. Okay, anyway. so our floating drawer has floated. So moving around a little bit there. Yeah, here we go. Ta -da, ta -da. Oh, it works so great. And I love this because it's it's up by itself. I don't have to hold it. Yeah, up. it's got these gas uh, shocks in it. Yeah, and then you can just push it down. Ta -da. Pretty cool. Yep, over here. Emergency exit. I just broke it. Emergency exit. Just hold it. Um, emergency exit. Let's see if I can do it. Uh, thermostat. 
Um, we've got heat. We've Light got switch. air. Yep. Uh, there's a place to put a television. You've got you can have satellite or cable right there. Your plug-in right there. Awesome. Yeah. And we have ducted air, and then of course there's yes. the other fan we talked about. I love the fact that we have ducted heat and air. We didn't. This have was that not before. actually a fan. There's two fans, and then this is a. Well, what is it? It just adds in air. Yeah, it's just a place for air to go out. I'm so disappointed. I thought it was a fan. Yeah, it's not. Okay. All right, there you have it. And there's then people that wire for a fan there. They just okay. take off one of these lights. And, okay. Or, if we need to go outside, we have a door right here. Door right here. In case, you know, if someone's sleeping up here. Yeah. You know, they may be sleeping on a thing. You can just shut this door and go out to the to the campsite or yeah. go to, you know, somewhere somewhere else. So, so. And if you'll notice, I don't know if I said this before, um, you can't see out the window. That means people can't see in, which I like. All right. Hey, thanks for coming into our new home, our second home, our home that we can take wherever we go if we want to. Um Appreciate you watching our walkthrough of our Grand Design Imagine 2500 RL in six days. Woohoo! Uh, we plan on taking her out for Memorial Day weekend and we can't wait. As always, we'd really appreciate it if you would like and subscribe to our videos and maybe even push the bell to get notified when they come out. Anything else? I think I'm just going to dream about being on the road again. I just can't wait to get on the road again. There you go. See you on down the road.